Hi everyone, this is Neil from Light Pillar. Welcome to part two of the Mosaic video series. Hopefully you've already watched part one of this series and are eagerly awaiting to see what's next. So let's get started and take a detailed look at layout views. To quickly recap, a layout view is a collection of layout icons and each icon represents the position and size your app will adopt. Mosaic gives you four layout view configurations so you can position your layout icons where they are most convenient for you. The first and default layout is the row view. As the name implies, your layout icons are displayed along a horizontal row. If there are too many layout icons for a single row, they will wrap onto a second like this. The vertical position of the row is configurable in the preferences on the positioning tab. Adjust the drag bar as shown. You can then test the position by dragging the preferences window. The second layout view is the column view and we can switch to this from the menu. This works the same as the row view but the layout icons are displayed vertically. If there are too many layout icons for a single column they will wrap onto two like this. As with the row view, you can adjust the horizontal position of the column in the preferences. Again, you can test the position by dragging the preferences window. The third layout view is the grid view. This aligns your layer icons onto a centrally positioned grid. Similar to both row and column views, the grid expands to accommodate the number of layer icons like this. And finally, we have the docked view. This creates a collection of half-sized layer icons that hang off the bottom of your menu bar. The smaller, more discreet layout view works really well with the drag to top of screen behavior like so. The docked view will also wrap onto multiple rows if there are too many layer icons, although the smaller size does mean you can fit a lot of icons on there. There is actually a fifth layout view, but this is displayed in a different manner depending on which activation mode you are using, and we'll talk about these in the next video. This fifth view is called Quick Layout. Quick Layout is great for those occasions when you don't have a suitable layout icon. For instance, it could be an app you don't use very often, but it has a specific layout requirement. When you activate Quick Layout, the currently active window is shown on the display, you then simply paint a rectangle on the grid to define the position and size you want applying. When you finish dragging, the layout is instantly applied. And just in case you didn't notice, Mosaic also displays your layout icons at the bottom of the quick layout display, just in case you change your mind and wish to apply an existing layout. So that concludes my demonstration of layout views all really great ways of giving you convenient access to your layout icons. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.